It was a pleasant, uh, rewarding feeling. This is something I've definitely been working for uh, for a long time. Uh, going relatively under the radar for most of my career, definitely felt good to be rewarded. When did you sort of find out? Uh, kind of towards the end of the season. I, I was hoping for it, of course, but I uh, finally found out in January, uh, right when we reported back after the ball game. How do you think, like last season, when you look back on it, how do you kind of grade yourself? Well, I uh, definitely had more ups than I did downs, mm -hmm. so I, I think that was a definite plus uh, to be able to come in and, and do what I did uh, as a walk-on and uh, to, to raise my level to uh, Division One status. I thought uh, I did well, uh, but I'm definitely going to shoot for higher goals and to become more consistent and efficient in what I do. I know uh, Coach Fountain said he thought after the Arkansas game the rest of the year was a little bit of, of a struggle. Did you just get tired, or was there just something that, like, Weight that you were kicking, like what? What would you maybe explain for that? Um, I think the best explanation for mm -hmm. that would be uh, simple mechanics. Mm -hmm. uh, had to ref get back to the basics and try to refine what I was doing. And as as a punter, you are or any type of specialist, you only have so few reps per game to mm -hmm. be able to address something. And yeah. so, uh, in a game such as that, you have to uh, stick through it and do your best to to bring your best back. And your next opportunity. Mm -hmm. How have you been putting so far this spring? I've been doing well. Uh, definitely adjusting to uh, been gaining a little weight, getting a little stronger, faster. So you do have to uh, mind your body and be able to figure out your uh, adaptation to what changes you've made. And so definitely trying to recalculate that and get back on top. Got any packages? You know, you know throw the ball some, maybe do some yeah. reverses or anything? I do whatever the coach needs me to do. How fun was that fake in the Birmingham? Probably the one of the highlights of my entire life uh, <laughs> so far, <laughs> all 20 years I've got going, so uh, it was definitely a fun feeling. You break the running backs, you have the better average, best average on the team. Run, we were actually talking about that earlier. Cool. We were. Um, <laughs> we we, we kind of joke about that, but I don't know. It's a one and done kind of deal, I, I believe, but if there were another opportunity to present itself. Go ahead, I'll tell you. Yeah, for sure. You're not going to stand next to Gus on the sidelines and go, Coach, give me the ball, give me the ball. <laughs> Put the ball in my hands, we'll see what happens. <laughs> Let's see if I can get a little lucky. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Big for your family too to get that scholarship money. Absolutely. Uh, that means uh, so much to my, my parents, especially because I know my uh, my father has been so supportive of everything I've ever done, and uh, for him to be able to fund a dream like this to to get out as a walk on out of state and uh, to support me and to finally have that and uh, reward to kind of a, a package to each other was definitely a sweet feeling. Thank you. For sure. Thank you.